Hey YouTube, this is Extra13, and today's like, today I'm going to make a video that's like kind of a following up to my old video. Uh, so here it is, my old one is how to, dis how to disable an iPod touch or an iPhone when it says iPod or iPhone is disabled, kind of like this. You can see what it says, and this is what happens when you plug it in. It's so you plug it into the, the computer with the USB, and this is what it says on your computer: that the the iTunes that iTunes cannot connect to the iPhone because that has been locked with the password, right? Okay, and then if you click try again click it it just goes away or just keeps reappearing so this is what you need to do to unlock it and have it working again okay so disconnect it turn your iPhone or iPod touch off completely and there this is actually the iPhone 3G you can probably see that it's way slower it's way slower than the iPhone 3GS just to tell you so keep waiting okay so it's turned off so this is what you need to do um this is this is how you are uh, need to do it to uh to get it back working okay so this is what you need to do okay so it's so you're gonna want to do it you're gonna um like I said turn it off completely see you can't turn it on and while holding the home button you want to keep holding this so hold it and at the same time plug the USB in still keep holding it and you can see okay uh then you just saw the Apple logo and then once this thing pops up you can release the home button it says iTunes and it shows the USB saying to connect to iTunes so when you do this is what it's gonna say iTunes has detected an i sorry uh, I don't know if you can read that iPhone has detected an iPhone in recovery mode so you want to press OK and then down here there's a restore button and you click restore restore and update uh... this is just like important information and what it's gonna do and stuff next and then you can see now it's downloading the, rest the restore program it's right there and you just wanna wait till it uh... fills up completely it takes a couple of minutes right now. It, mine's going to take around four minutes. So I'll hit you back when it's done. Hey, you two. Okay, well, uh, it's nearly done. There's 19 seconds remaining. And your iPhone or iPod Touch should still say this. Okay. 12 seconds. 11, 10, 9. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, five, four, three, two, one. Okay, you see how much? Okay, and once it's done, it should say extracting software. If you click stop, don't click stop because if you do, it just restarts the whole entire thing, and you don't want that to happen. So wait till this to be done. Done. And then it says preparing iPhone for restore. And your iPhone should like turn off completely. Like just turn black. 
Well, maybe not turn off, but it. Yeah, there, you, there we go. The Apple logo. Preparing an iPhone free store. And this next part takes quite a while. Um. Yeah. This yeah, this part takes quite a while. I gotta say it does. Cause it still has to like take everything off and do all this other stuff. See that whole thing has to fill up. So I'll get back to you when that thing when the when the loader bar is when the loading bar is full. Okay? I'll get back to you, I promise. Alright. Okay, I'm back. Uh, as you can see, it's nearly finished. Just a tiny bit left. And the whole time it's just going to be saying this. Be storing iPhone firmware. Okay, that's what it's going to that's what's going to happen and then it says iPhone has been restored to the faculty settings and is restarting. Please leave your iPhone connected. Okay? Uh the Apple thing will come up, Apple logo. And then right after this, you're pretty much good to go. You just exactly. Um, this will go by pretty fast, as you can see. Okay, that's done with that. Apple logo and no SIM card is installed. Um, that's why you're gonna want to jailbreak or unlock your jailbreak or unlock your iPhone. But if it was on the iPod Touch, you'd be good to go, good to use it. But since this doesn't have a SIM card in it, then you have to jailbreak it. But yeah, as you can see, it doesn't say that anymore. Okay, well, thanks for watching YouTube. Hope you learned something. Uh, please subscribe. That way, I think. Subscribe. Comment. Comment down there. Rate down there. And thank you. Alright, bye YouTube. Thanks.